Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's always a good day when I get to try out new products from my favorite brand. Today is all about the Westman Atelier Squeaky Lip Balms. I grabbed four of them and the plan is I'm gonna try them on by themselves and then I'm gonna try some of them on on top of some lipstick colors from the Lip Suede Compact, okay? So we've got two different things going on. We'll swatch. We're gonna talk a little bit, mostly just try everything on. So if you wanna see what colors are on my lip and what this very cute thing is on my head. Just keep watching and please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate it when you do. Now let's jump in. Okay guys, before we jump into these Westman Atelier new lip products, I have to talk about my Breezy Tea products of the day. I'm wearing our Bordeaux Boho Head Wrap in this beautiful, rich, rich color. Um, they're a long piece of stretchy fabric. Fashion them into any style you want. They have a beautiful sheen on them to give you a sophisticated chic finish. They come in lots of colors. And yeah, they're perfect for days that you don't wanna do your hair. You just wanna jazz your hair up a little bit. They, we have neutral colors, we have brighter colors. So if you just want a punch of color in your outfit, this is the perfect way to do it. If you wanna check out any of our boho head wraps, just visit us at breezytea.com or our Etsy shop. All of the links will be in the description below as well as a link directly to this shade. So if you've seen a video, a Westman Atelier video of mine before, you know that Westman Atelier is my favorite brand. My face is Westman atelier out. Everything I have on my face will also be in the description, but they just released these squeaky clean liquid lip balms. I grabbed four of them. I believe there are six of them. I grabbed four. Let's break down this packaging. You see all my plates of Westman back here, but to, to keep in line with their fantastic packaging, we have the glossy cap and the matte uh, body of it. It does say Westman Atelier here, chic as ever. And for these products, there's a little window so you can see the color that you're purchasing. Westman Atelier, it's just on top of it in terms of packaging. I said this visually along with Hermes, Westman Atelier is my other favorite packaging. Knock it out the box completely. And these also feel substantial. They always feel luxurious. They look luxurious, so they always hit on that uh, way. Each one comes in this box that I absolutely love. And each one has its own little canvas bag, okay, that it's housed in. So that was the complete packaging experience. So Gucci Westman studied uh, makeup, went to her makeup school in France. So that's where she was schooled on makeup. So she chose names that are terms of endearment in French. Terms of endearment also happens to be my absolute favorite movie of all times. That movie is just, I love Terms of Endearment. So I got Nana, okay, that's one of them. I got Garçon, that's one. I got Chouchou, that's another. And I got Mapuse, okay? And those are the four that I got. We're gonna, like I said, we'll try those on individually. We're gonna try them on with a complimentary shade from the Lip Suede Compact. And the tinted clean lip treatment that cushions lips with weightless juicy nourishment to hydrate and protect. Naturally derived pigments, it's clean, has an innovative gel oil system uh, to give you an unforgettable, unforgettable pillowy luxurious sheen. Okay, so that's what they're saying about this lip balm. So let's try them out.
so I wanted to pause now that I've tried them all on. The one I'm wearing now is my Pousse, the last one I tried on. Here are all four colors. So the first one is a really light pink chouchou. This second one here is Nana, which is a beigey pink. I really love this one alone. This one is Garçon, which is like a mauve color. Love this one alone on my lips. And my Pousse is beautiful also alone on my lips. The only one I think I would need to wear over something in terms of trying to get color is Chouchou. However, as just something on my lips, a clear gloss texture on my lips, I could wear it alone. But the other three colors, I really love how the, the pigmentation shows up on me, so I could wear them alone or on top of something else. What I'm grappling with a little bit is if I would call this a balm. I don't know that I would. This wears to me like a lip gloss. It's juicy, it's beautiful, the formula's lovely on the lips. I absolutely love that oil to gel formula. The oil gives the lips just this nice slick finish to it. Um, so I have nothing bad to say about the formula and how it wears, but would I call it a balm? This is very interesting. Before they came out with these products, I loved to wear their lit up stick, the original shade, as a balm. I swatched it for you, I want you to see the difference. This one is lit up stick, and then these are the squeaky clean balms. Look how the squeaky clean balms are raised because it's thicker. And this here is flat on my skin. This is what I would consider a balm, okay? That consistency, that is how I wear my balms. That's just how I always wear my balm. They were like this on the lips. They weren't raised like glosses. They weren't thick like glosses. So then that becomes just a personal choice. How do you like to wear your balm? For me, these are gonna wear like lip glosses that I love, that feel great, that I will get a lot of use of, but I don't know that I consider this a balm. So a bit of semantics there. They don't have anything in their collection yet like this product, so it's not like it's competing with anything. I think it's a beautiful, bit of gloss or balm on your lips on its own or a topper to something else which we're going to do now so let's try these on with a little bit of their beautiful lip suede colors okay we have our colors here of the lipstick we'll try them with the balm and see what we come up with enjoyed I just I didn't do shushu I didn't have a color in the compact that I thought would um, suit it really well but we're gonna end it with this little pop of color um, very very pretty really nice it feels amazing still the the lip suede on its own I love that lip suede everything feels really smooth and soothing and just nourishing on the lips alone so to add the uh, squeaky clean lip balm on top of it it's just a nice topper situation for me. Not tacky, not particularly sticky at all. It wears really nicely on me, the squeaky clean lip balm by itself and with the lip suede colors. So this was fun and I hope you enjoyed. Let me know, did you get any of these squeaky clean lip balms? What are you thinking about the shades? Are you liking them? What are you thinking about the consistency? Is it a balm? Is, do you consider it more of a gloss? Let me know. Whatever you call it, I'm really happy to have them. They're beautiful, clean formulas, chic packaging yet again. And for me, my biased opinion, personally.
perhaps. Another winner for Westman Atelier, and I'm always looking forward to um, what they're gonna do next. And of course, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate you, I appreciate you, I appreciate you. Uh, share if you think this will help someone out. Uh, and if you wanna check out any of our boho head wraps, t-shirt, hair towel wraps, satin line beanies, satin line knit beanies, silk and linen accessories, we have new fabrics coming in next week that I cannot wait um, to get out there. Really fun printed fabrics that we're gonna make into some of our products. So I'm excited for what's coming. You can visit us at breezytea.com or our Etsy shop. Again, all links will be in the description below. I will check you guys in the next video. Ciao for now, bye.